What is up everybody? Welcome back to the channel. I'm out here for another adventure on my trip in the Pacific Northwest. Beautiful view of a mountain behind me. I'm currently on my way doing a trip up to a mountain lake. I'm gonna spend two nights up here. Gonna hike around, explore, cook some good food. Buddy Rob is supposed to be joining me here. He is mostly gonna be behind the camera helping me get shots. He is uh, trailing behind, so at the rate I'm going, he might catch up to me, who knows. This trail is already kicking my butt. I'm not that far into it, but um, that's part of the adventure. <laughs> Hoping to get up to the campsite uh, before it gets dark. Who knows if we're gonna make that or not, I don't know. But yeah, I got a couple good beers. I got some good whiskey. I got some good meals. We're gonna enjoy nature. We're gonna see what this place has to offer. Take in the sights, do it all up. But before I do any of that, I've gotta take a little nip off of the old banana flask. Whew. Oh my goodness sakes. Whew. That is that uh, Howler Head banana flavored whiskey bourbon deal that I found out here. I think you can get it anywhere, but <laughs> not quite sure if I like it yet, but I'm a long way from home and that's what we're working with for the remainder of these trips. Woo! I think it might be growing on me. Let's hit the trail. There is definitely some kind of waterfall behind me. Um, you can hear it plain as day. I can't see anything. I didn't see anything online about a waterfall, but um, gonna be up here for two days. So um, see if we can't find it. Whew, I am drenched. I'm sweating up a storm. It's absolutely ridiculous. Every time I stop, I start getting cold. Every time I start moving, I start sweating again. <laughs> I mean, I don't know. Whew, this one really takes it out of you. I'm gonna have to get into better shape if I were to be doing this full time. I am earning that campsite, I'll tell you right now. Yeah, so this is a uh, absolutely beautiful trail so far. Um, it's uh, definitely some switchbacks and just an overall upward grade, but everything is covered in moss. There's ferns around, very well maintained trail. Um, and all these little trickling waterfalls just spotted all over the place. It's really gorgeous. Just talked to a nice older couple who is in much, much better shape than I am and having a much faster trip of it than I am. Um, gave me a bunch of uh, good information about where to go and um, things to see up here. So uh, there's a beautiful lookout point. I'm gonna try to make it there before dark. Um, and we'll see what happens. But uh, good thing is I got a whole nother day to spend up here, so very excited. Woo! Oh, I'll check back with you guys in a bit. Oh man, right now I'm at this absolutely beautiful lookout point. Um, it's pitch black dark, so you can't see it. Um, I am missing a, a ton of really pretty kind of geological stuff and just interesting things to see. So 
I'm either gonna come back down tomorrow um, and, and get some shots of everything just so you guys can see what the rest of the trail looks like or I'll do a montage on the way out when I'm finished. So, um, and just show you guys some highlights. So either way, stay tuned for that. You're gonna see the rest of what's in the darkness here. But for now, we gotta get to the campsite. Woo. I need to be very, very careful because this is, I'll be honest, this is a little on the dangerous side, but I'm being exceptionally careful. I promise, honey. And right on cue, there's the rain. Yeah. You gotta love it. I got the pack under there. We're pretty much good to go. This is the very first campsite I came across. Honestly, it's not exactly ideal, um, but it's gonna work. Turn that off so I don't bind you guys. Um, I'm gonna run a tarp between these two trees, just so I got a place to sit and relax and, and cook dinner. And uh, yeah, I'll get back with you guys once uh, everything's set up because it's a little bit of a precarious situation here. Hey there. Okay, so I did get my tarp set up. Um, it's a bit of a puddle forming under here. Um, kind of what happens when you show up to a campsite where you're not familiar with, you don't have a lay of the land and it's dark and you don't know what's going on. So trying to make the best of it. It's not that bad, but it, it's a little bit of a puddle. So whew. I got to think for a minute, plan my next move and then, uh, get back with you guys in a little bit. Okay, it's the best uh, filming situation we're gonna get here. I am in the tent. Buddy Rob has joined me. Rob, say hi. Hi. <laughs> he is uh, in his tent over there. I got some footage of the outside, so I'll go ahead and insert that in now. But basically that's our setup, and that's what we're working with for the night. Um, he was behind me because he had to work today. Um, so he did most of this hike in the dark and in the rain. It was only in the dark and rain at the ladder portion for myself. Um, it still has not uh, been a picnic. I'll tell you that right now. I'm gonna get the sleeping mat set up and the sleeping bag unrolled and get into some uh, dry clothes. And then I'll check with you guys when I'm about to hit the hay here and uh, Go ahead and uh, sign off for you for the night. We still got all day tomorrow, so um, uh, stay tuned for that. Ugh. There's the boots right inside the vestibule there. Good night, Rob. Good night. Woo. I'm in the tent here. Got my pillow. Trying out a new sleeping mat. I'll talk to you guys about that another time. Um, got my sleeping bag here. Got my puffy coat on me just in case it gets cold there's the camera lens there it is okay we had nuts and beef jerky for dinner um sorry i didn't film more of it but it was uh kind of a little bit of a nightmare scenario getting everything situated i'll talk to you more about it tomorrow but i am 100 energy zapped and i've got to hit the hay so 
Um, I'll catch back with you guys in the morning. Anything crazy happens, of course, you know, I'll always film it. Otherwise, catch you guys in the morning. Good night. Good morning, everybody. Rain doesn't seem to be letting up. Uh, I'm gonna try to at least get up and get something to eat. Um, that means I gotta change back into the wet clothes that haven't dried <laughs> and um, out of these nice warm clothes. Um, but I'm um, gonna try to make something out of the day here. So at least I gotta get something to eat check back with you guys when I'm outside of the tent because this is a tight squeeze and it's going to be a little tricky here. Okay, now I've got to show you guys this stuff. We had no idea that this view was right there. That is Crazy. So up at the top here, I mean, this thing just keeps on going. It's just some kind of stream that just goes back up in there. Well, let's follow it. So that stream comes from back up over there. I think it even goes further than that. It comes all the way down here, all the way out there, meanders all the way down and then lets down in our campsite. fish for you know when I get up and going. I'll probably try to fish. I'll see how easy it is if we can if it's even worth it. Boom. If you want some tea, I get a bunch of, I, I usually make double strong tea bag. Good caffeine? Yeah. Yeah that'd be cool. Oh, Rob uh, was nice enough to make me some tea. He's got a jet boil over there like a real professional. Um, and I'm messing around with this alcohol still. I don't know if it's gonna work out for me 
exactly the way I thought. It's going to be a bit of a struggle, so I might have to uh, borrow his uh, dealie over there, but Rob was enough to make me some uh, double caffeinated. You got it, buddy. All right. Some double caffeinated tea for the morning. Oh, man. Yeah, that hit the spot. Oh, man. Yeah, that's good. That is good stuff. Fortune is smiling on us a bit here. Oh my goodness, Say, Sun is poking out. It's actually starting to warm up a little bit. Getting a chance to dry off. Even if it doesn't hold up for us, uh, we'll appreciate it while it's here. Oh, this little guy here is called a rose hip. And this is supposed to be edible. Rob informed me on this. So we're gonna go ahead and give it a try. It's not great. It tastes like I'm eating like a flower. It tastes like I'm eating like a big bunch of leaves or something. It's a bit sour. I can't believe you fell for that. <laughs> oh, I think we spoke a little too soon on the old rain there. It seems to be coming back in. Don't want to get any wetter than we were. Let's get all zipped up here. That's great. I went ahead and used Rob's jet foil. That alcohol stove was uh, just not cutting it. Mm -mm. I got my boots and uh, socks over in the sun. I do have a spare set of um, socks, but I'm saving those to sleep in. Rob and I have just been uh, chilling out, drinking some coffee, having some breakfast, chit-chatting, catching up on uh, old times and everything. And yes, I don't know what we're gonna do from here. We're, we're kind of game planning it out. There's a lot of options and uh, definitely get back with you guys in a bit and let you know what we're getting into here. In a uh, huge dramatic turn of events, we have blue sky, we have some light clouds. I mean, it doesn't get much better than this. This is not the prediction for today. It was supposed to rain nonstop. So we'll take it. All right, we're gonna go do ourselves a little hike. That's what we decided. We're gonna take lunch up there, have a little snack. But uh, apparently there is a viewpoint overlook um, thing and we're gonna try to find it and uh, we'll film it and show it to you guys. So, but before I do that, I have a blister on my foot and I'm gonna have to deal with it.
Doesn't look too bad. It's like this times 10. Yeah. You're going and like if you go to the hoe. That's so cool. It's gonna look like I did everything and you did nothing in the video. Off camera, I can like yell words and words. <laughs> <laughs> Cut right through it, Sam. Push yourself past the max. Wow, good job. <laughs> it's so nice to have your words of affirming 
wisdom. <sighs> oh yeah. I'm gonna give you like some small pieces mm -hmm. if you want to tuck them in yep. underneath yep. there. Yep. About right or what? Yeah, that looks good. I'll take it. Do another. What a bing. Mrs. Bananas Chili, rehydrated, cheese, green onions, and a Taco Bell hot sauce. Can't go wrong. Thanks, babe. Ooh, it's a beautiful night. Rob and I are gonna walk on over to the lake and see if uh, we can do some little night photography here. You gotta focus. There we go. Perfect. Rob was nice enough to hook us up with a uh, Snickers bar for dessert, so we're both having Snickers. Cheers, Rob. Cheers, buddy. Cheers. Eat all of that. Mm -hmm. You don't want to store that in your tent in bear country, buddy. Num num num. Yeah. There we go. Woo! Really enjoy it. I'm trying hard. Mmm. Cool, man. Oh, I'm gonna crack into this uh, Storm Surge Hazy IPA because we definitely want this gone as we hike out tomorrow. Um, we want as little weight as possible, so we've eaten as much food as we could and um, I had three of those uh, chili burritos. Good stuff. Um, we got a little mouse running around here. I keep trying to capture it. I don't know. I'm hopefully able to get a little, get our little friend on camera here. But um, I had my tortillas sitting here, and the little sucker came up around the back, jumped on here while we weren't looking, chewed through the bag, and. Um, took a little bit of bite out of that tortilla so that's all junk now I'm not gonna eat after that but yeah so I mean he's an aggressive little little fella yeah cheers do you see him oh we're gonna have 8,000 videos of trying to catch this freaking mouse 
Okay, made short work out of that first one. Got a second beer here. Red Hook Long Hammer IPA. Yeah, good stuff. Getcha. Did I get him? Yeah, I, I got him. Oh, you got one. There's another one. Where'd he go? He's gone. Oh my god, there's a bunch of them. It's a mating season or something? No, yeah, just it's the forest. <laughs> he is just staring right at me. I don't know what's going on. I don't want to scare him. So we are in bear country here. Um, trying to be as safe as possible. Hopefully this is a good uh, hang here. We're gonna get the uh, food and every the trash and everything up into the tree and then we'll get it down in the morning here. I think that should be pretty good. Ugh. It's up there. Hopefully that bear doesn't try to climb out on that limb like that, but it's pretty slim, so I think it's a pretty good move. All right, everybody. I got my uh, pillow tucked in the sleeping bag. Boots are outside of the tent there. Um, Rob and I had a nice night hanging out, looking at the silhouette of the mountain. Been a wonderful trip. This is our last night. And then tomorrow we'll be packing up and heading out. So I'm going to enjoy a uh, nice night here. Nice sleep. Anything crazy happens, I'll definitely film it for you guys. But otherwise, I will uh, I'll check back with you in the morning. Good night, everybody. Well, for breakfast this morning, I'm just doing a bar 
Rob's doing a bar too. A little piece of beef jerky. And uh, we're gonna pack up and head on out of here. Rob's gotta go back to work. And I got one more uh, night of camping. But I gotta move to a new spot. So after this, we'll head on out of here and I'll get you those shots that uh, I promised on the way in. It's a wild hike out, but definitely got some gorgeous views. And uh, yeah, as promised, I'm gonna show it to you. That's beautiful. Yeah. Wow. Goodness sakes. Oh man, hopefully the audio is working out okay here. Um, yeah, crazy storm came in, crazy rain. Um, it's all right, it's just all part of the fun. Um, we're gonna wrap this video up here. That's another one in the books. I'm so happy I did it. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you liked this video, go ahead and click that banana. It would really mean a lot to me. And we're gonna catch you on the next one, everybody. Bye now.